Hi friends, welcome to my channel Travel with Siri. I learned sewing skills only to upcycle old clothes to apparels. In today's video, I'll tell you about my journey towards learning sewing skills and why is it important to reduce textile waste. This is not a tutorial video as I'm not an expert in stitching. I am still in that learning phase and developing my sewing skills to work more on textile wastes. It is not an easy job to upcycle. I faced many ups and downs in the process of learning to stitch and made many mistakes. But I feel every mistake gives us an experience to learn from it and not to repeat those mistakes again. The only reason I learned sewing skills is to mend the textile wastes that we generate unknowingly. So in this video you can have a glimpse on how I work on cutting, designing and stitching a school uniform to a tote bag. Our kids grow very fast and school uniforms get short very quickly. Some of us donate these clothes to the needy, but if you are throwing them, just remember that you are polluting the environment as textile waste is causing a major impact in producing toxic greenhouse gases. I feel it is important to upcycle the textiles or any wastes before recycling. It is crucial to understand and get educated on the importance of the wastes we generate on daily basis. Do you know that majority of the textiles produced are dumped into the landfills due to the fast fashion culture? These days there are many shopping malls every corner offering us wide range of clothes attracting us to purchase more. Fashion changes very quickly and to keep up with the trend, we keep on purchasing clothes only to find our closets overfilled. And when it's time for spring cleaning, we all dump those outdated fabrics into the trash and to our surprise, some of them are still with the tags on which have never been used. Even I was unaware that textile waste causes pollution to the environment. But in 2020 when Singapore implemented circuit breaker due to COVID-19, I thought of clearing up our wardrobes that were overfilled. Previously, whenever I visited my home country, India, I used to bring all my old clothes to donate them to the needy. But due to COVID-19, as we were unable to travel to India, I found there were many clothes piled up and thought of approaching a nearby charity organization. Out of curiosity, I just researched if these clothes would be sent to the needy and found out that even those organizations receive tons of clothes, toys, electronic goods, etc. and they have to ultimately dump them into the landfills. It then added more to my curiosity and slowly I learned about textile wastes and other wastes that we dump into the landfills that further decompose and produce toxic greenhouse gases. These gases affect our environment causing global warming. Textile industry itself is responsible for nearly 20% of water pollution and releases 10% of carbon emissions into the air. Do you know that just 1 kg of clothes can generate nearly 23 kg of greenhouse gases? So, in this process of learning, I self-taught and developed sewing skills by watching YouTube videos. I have decided not to purchase clothes at least for another few years. and i am prepared to reuse the clothes that are sitting in my wardrobe i wish and hope that people recognize and understand the importance of fabric upcycling and adapt sustainable ways in their daily lives if you wish to support my channel please like my video and don't forget to subscribe my channel and activate the bell in order to get notified